Let's call the meeting to order. Call the roll, please. Mr. Cox. Here. Mr. Kella. Here. Mr. Moore. Here. Mr. Rusinellis. Here. Mr. Walden. Here. Mr. Chairman, members of the commission, we've got uh, the duly advertised plan commission uh, for the month of April. 2016. We've got three items on the agenda under consideration. However, there are the first two are uh, at this time being requested for tabling. Uh, so we'll start with the first one under old business. We've got letter 3A, and that is the uh, annexation and the classification at 420 Rowell Avenue. We're still trying to work out the public improvements requirements that will be a part of this annexation for that section of Rowell Avenue, and they're working this through the uh, Public Works Department to see what uh, we can and cannot do there. So they're asking that the matter be tabled for another 30 days. Uh, and then... Uh, yeah. um, they're going to withdraw and come back with a smaller okay. piece, not, not the old beach club. Okay. So I've gotten a withdrawal, so they're going to refund okay. as a smaller... Yeah, Jim's just telling me now that the current discussion is that they might withdraw the petition this petition to annex the entire piece. This is the old Joliet Beach Club property. Yes. And they make uh, the, the property that's to the north of it, there's another piece of property that's not in the city limits that they're talking about bringing in. So now what they're talking about doing is maybe bringing in a smaller parcel, not the entire piece, which would then alleviate them of the requirement to fix up that section of Rowell Avenue because they wouldn't be using it at, the, at this point in time. So that's what the discussion is. So again, if we could have a motion to table this or uh, for the next, 30 days to the next meeting. Okay, motion is in order for A-1-16. So moved. Second. Call the roll, please. Mr. Moore. Aye. Mr. Rusinellis. Aye. Mr. Walden. Aye. Mr. Cox. Aye. Mr. Kella. Aye. The next case for request for table is at the corner of Lairway Road and Route 52. It's a 38.4 acre parcel of property. The original re request was to annex it and to zone it and to allow for a special use permit for a trucking corporation to locate at that, on that property. Uh, they are in the process now of looking at the possibility of adding a little bit more property to the footprint that they seek. So they're going to be talking to the adjoining property owners to see if that's doable at this point in time. So they requested that we table this until the June meeting and that they thought would give them sufficient time to see if they could negotiate more property, which would then give them a, a larger annexation footprint. And so we support them on that request uh, to see if that can be done. And so at this point in time, and I think we do have the attorney, Mike Hansen's the attorney representing that Estes Trucking Corporation. So th uh, that, is, that is the request at hand. Okay. Any comment, Mike, or do you want to go ahead and park eight? Motion is in order for A-2-16. So moved. Second. Call the roll, please. Mr. Rusinellis. Aye. Mr. Walden. Aye. Mr. Cox. Aye. Mr. Moore. Aye. Mr. Kella. Aye. Okay, on the agenda, we're left with, under the new business portion, uh, number five, letter A. We've got two things under consideration now. We've got P-1-16 which is the preliminary plat of the Center Point Intermodal Center Subdivision Phase 13. We've got FP1-16, which is the final plat of the Center Point Intermodal Center at Joliet Phase 13 Subdivision. In all of these matters, the applicant and the owners are Center Point Joliet Terminal Railroad LLC. The request is the approval of the preliminary and the final plat of subdivision. The purpose is to create seven industrial lots for present and future development. This area is zoned IT. Uh, letter C, which is the intermodal terminal industrial park. The location is at the northeast corner of Center Point Way and Baseline slash Vetter Roads. The size of the, this parcel is 149 acres and it currently is part of an industrial business park. Surrounding land use and zoning to the north is residential, which is an unincorporated Will County. To the south is industrial IT, to the east is the same. To the west is agricultural, which is an unincorporated Will County, and also in some city industrial I, uh, I-2 zoning. Under site history, Center Point Joliet Railroad LLC has petitioned for multiple requests, heard and approved by the Plan Commission and the Mayor and City Council for the Center Point Intermodal Center at Joliet Development. The majority of the property, the intermodal rail yard, was annexed, zoned IT, and approved with an annexation agreement as part of Phase 1 back in December of 08. 
Phase two, which included all of the center point holdings at the time, was approved in March of 2010. Under special information, the petitioners requesting the approval of phase 13 preliminary and final plats in order to allow the subdivision and continued industrial development of the center point intermodal center. Seven lots uh, included in the subdivision proposal, they range in size from two to 82 acres. The 1.4 million square foot Mars warehousing and distribution facility is currently under construction in the area designated for lots 57. Lot 55 in, includes 7.5 acres and lot 58 includes 22.5 acres in both our buildable lots. There are no current development plans for these lots at this time. The remaining lots will be utilized for the previously vacated baseline road and the naturalized native wet planting storm water detention areas. The proposed development plans to comply with the IT zoning and the city's non-residential design standards as well as the landscape ordinances. All public improvements will be required as part of the subdivision regulations and the public works and utilities departments. Sewer and water connection, sewer surcharge fees and development impact fees will be required as previously agreed to. And then lastly, the Community Design Review Board uh, re reviewed this matter out at their March 3rd meeting. The minutes are available and that concludes the staff report. May I have the petitioner please? Good afternoon, Your Honor. Michael Hansen, attorney representing uh, Centerpoint. Anything to add? You know, the staff report is correct, Your Honor. We uh, move for uh, recommendation for approval. Any uh, questions from the commission? I have one question. Um, on this uh, topical view, it says to the west that it's agricultural and unincorporated. It looks like there's a building there. Is that is that a house or a residence or just on the west of the uh, green line here? The Wong building? Yeah, that's no, not the long, well, right here. That's well, step, kind of step and chemical. That's uh, part of the center point development project. Is that a, a is that what we're talking about to the west right there? It's just the, the white spot there? It yeah. looks like a oh. roof with a driveway building. right there. Oh, there. Oh, right. Yeah. What is it? Oh, building. Oh, building. Barn. Barn. Oh, but it's not yeah, habitable it's like or anything? Development. Yeah. Okay. Probably used for farming. Okay. Any other questions? Any questions from the audience? Then a motion's in order. We're going to do them both at the same time? Mm -hmm. Yes, for could. Uh, FP-1-16. I don't know, you may, you may have people in the audience here that are here for this case. I did. Do we not acknowledge them? I did, but nobody. Okay. No questions? Okay. So, we're, so motion is ordered for FP-1-16 and P-1-16. So moved. Second. All the roll, please. Mr. Walden. Aye. Mr. Cox. Aye. Mr. Kella. Aye. Mr. Moore. Aye. Mr. Rusinellis. Aye. Thank you. Thank right. you, Michael. All right, next up under, we have study session with nothing on that agenda. Uh, item number seven is the approval of the minutes that uh, from the February 18th meeting. Uh, is there a motion to approve the minutes? So moved. Is there a second? Second. A any discussion or changes? No. All in favor signify by aye. 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 Any nays? The minutes stand approved. And lastly is the adjournment. Uh, do I hear a motion to adjourn? So moved. Second. Second. All in favor signify by aye. Aye. Thank you. We are adjourned. <laughs>